everybody can agree, a little more kindness, a little more grace, a little more joy, a little more love goes a long way. Cultivating kindness to me is, is really um, everything. And one of the ways we make a difference is by just sprinkling a little kindness everywhere we go. And that's why you see the bee in so much of our decor and everything. You know, bees go out and they pollinate everywhere. And we have this idea that we just go out and pollinate kindness into the world and that that's part of how it grows. So what we talk about is loving people with food. John was really the driver in thinking that Pop-Tarts would be great. I was a quick second. We were also making our own fresh jams for the table, and so that also then became a springboard. So every six or eight weeks, we get to innovate a new Pop-Tart. My wife, uh, her granola recipes on the menu is Lolo's granola. The avocado toast is very popular and a go-to. Uh, I also love our, our mimosas and Bloody Marys, so I'm in here quite often and I move through the menu all the time. A perfect day would be spending the morning at the Sedgwick County Zoo. Uh, it's one of the top 15 zoos in the country. Spending an, uh, an afternoon at Exploration Place and walking along the river and seeing the Keeper of the Plains and where the two rivers converge. There's just great places to go all over. Cowtown, the Art Museum. Wichita's always kind of outpunched its weight when it comes to creativity and the art scene here. You see the, the art in the community is everywhere. Even the painting behind me now, we hire a local artist uh, to do a painting in each one of our restaurants that symbolizes Wichita and community and kindness to them. I really connect with the idea of Wichita being the heart of the country. It's very special. Never seen anything quite like it. And uh, you see it in the smiles as you walk down the street, the desire to greet people. I've never seen the warmth and the generosity that Wichita has to offer and offers freely. It would be something, but if you can pour a little kindness to someone's life in the first half of their day, they're more likely to pour that into the people they interact with in the second half of the day.